Hey everyone, it's Stars and Dust coming to you from CrystalChalice.com website once again. This week I have another great tutorial for you, so sit back, relax, and let me take the reins for a while. This time I'm going to show you how to create an autofill in Microsoft Word. First off, you will need to have Microsoft Word open and the document that you wish to create your auto text from. Next, you want to create and format the text you want to preserve as auto text. So I will do that now. Highlight the text. I'm going to change it to this blue color. Find that right here. And then I'm going to align it right. And I think I'll make it bold just to make it stand out just a bit. Now with the text highlighted, because you need it highlighted on the page, go to the Insert tab, go to Quick Parts, click on Auto Text, and then click on Save Selection to Auto Text Gallery. Okay, it came in as Yahoo Comics because that's what was highlighted on the page. Next come to Options down here. And you can insert content only. And that will insert the entry in line with the cursor position. Or insert content in its own paragraph. And that will insert the entry with a line break before or after it or else you can choose this last one which is insert content in its own page and that will insert the entry with a page break before or after it next you want to click OK click OK right here OK and now you've created the quick part go up here and check it and you can see it was created right here so let's get rid of this text right here so we can show how we can bring it in and we'll have our cursor all the way to the left so you can see that it comes in just the way we created it now make sure you're in the insert panel go back to quick parts click on it click on auto text comics right here and you can see it came in completely formatted just the way we created it okay now if you want to get rid of it all you have to do is go back to the insert panel go to the quick parts again go down here to building blocks organizer and sometimes you'll have to scroll all the way down in order to find it but I see mine is right here at the top so just click on that and then come down here and you can click delete or edit the properties if that's what you want to do We'll just delete it right now because that's what I'm going to show you how to do. So just delete it. And yes, we want to delete it. And sometimes this will not completely delete. When I show you right here, it could be still there. Yes, it's still there. So when that happens, you have to close out of the program. And Word is acting silly again, as it always does. Okay, and reopen the program. And then see if it's still there. And it's gone. So, if you want to recreate it again, remember you have to highlight it, go to Insert, go to Quick Parts, go to Auto Text, and then save it once again as election. You have to have the text selected on the page in order to save it as a selection. Okay, so there's your little tutorial on how to create Quick Parts Auto Text for Microsoft Word. Thank you.